Hi world and welcome to this eyebrow tutorial video. In this video I'm gonna show you how to create a very natural brow with just one brush and eyebrow creams. So first off I'm gonna start with brushing the brow so I can see the natural flow of the natural eyebrow hairs and then I'm gonna choose the colors that I need to create a very natural tinted eyebrow. First off, I'm gonna create extra hairs where the eyebrow is missing some. And when I have created the hairs where I want them, I'm gonna add some more depth with the flat side of the brush and add some shading. You can soften up the eyebrows by using the other side of the brush and brush out the excess of the product. I always tend to follow the bone structure in the face and the muscles. I try to respect that because, you know, that's what will make it more natural. So now the hardest part. Making them look like twins instead of sisters. So for the other side I had to create some extra hairs in the front because the base of her other eyebrow didn't come as deep as the other side. So to make it more symmetrical I added some hairs and some shading to make it look very natural. And then it's like just do add hairs, compare, add shading, brush it out and make something satisfying. Are you writing? Say you never ever leave from beside me. Cause I want you and I need you. And I'm down for you always, JT. Do you love me? Are you writing? Say you never ever leave from beside me. Cause I want you and I need you. And I'm down for you always. For the creams, there are four different shades. And I use a 220 brush from Makeup Designery. You have straw, cinnamon, ash and bark. In the shades you have like a cool tone blonde, then a more warm base light brown, a middle tone cool brown and then a dark cool brown. Here I'm gonna show you how I create a very natural eyebrow from scratch and I start with using the slanted side of the brush and I just well build up hairs one by one and create an eyebrow. But to make it more realistic, you need more depth. So after uh, brushing away the excess of the hairs you created, you want to use the flat side of the brush and then add in some shading. For shading, I usually go for a more lighter tone so you can still see the difference between the hairs you created and the shading you're adding. So after I've done my shading and I'm gonna go back and use the darker color to create some extra hairs to make it more realistic. <laughs> That's it. That's how you create a very natural eyebrow. I hope this tutorial was helpful, but you know, practice makes perfect. So just keep on doing it and maybe I'll see you back in another video. Bye.